welcome if you're looking for a simple way to set fitness or weight loss goal and track fitness activities and measure progress against your fitness goals then in this video i will provide a simple five step process to do so using a single excel spreadsheet template this template is available for download from inzara.com and i will provide a link to the product in the video description below now let's get started here's the process step number 1 based on the height and your current weight set a weight goal which is reasonable within a specified time frame step number 2 choose specific fitness activities which will enable you to reach your weight goal for example i could be targeting 30 minutes of walking every day or 20 miles of biking a week could be 6 hours of meditation per week and it could also be not just physical activities but it could be habits like i want to eat my dinner before 7 pm every day i want to avoid sugar 5 days a week so anything that you believe are activities that you want to do in order to achieve your weight goal step number 3 planning as they say if you fail to plan then you are planning to fail so my suggestion would be every sunday you sit down and take the time and plan for your coming week so it would include specifically which day which activity you are planning to do at what time and for the duration so how long are you planning to do those activities so be specific and schedule out your week this is extremely important when you're planning the planner will tell you if you do this set of activities will you be able to achieve your target goals for the week make sure that your plan is set up in order for you to meet those goals a quick tip would be if you can print the planner for the week and stick it where in your office or home wherever you will be able to see it multiple times every day this will act as a good reminder for you about the plan that you have committed to step number 4 this is the hardest part which is to actually execute your plan and do those fitness activities exactly at the time for the duration that you committed and planned for so during this stage make sure that you record the activities you are doing and you can do this in two ways so you can either do it in the spreadsheet itself by entering whenever you finish your run or whenever you finish your biking or whatever the fitness activities may be record them in the spreadsheet the other option you have is you can print our tracking sheet on a piece of paper and then you can write it down whatever activities you are doing and at the end of the day or every few days you can take that data and put it into our spreadsheet my recommendation would be at least once a week make sure that you take that data and put it into the spreadsheet step number 5 is to measure your progress against your goals the template creates a fitness dashboard automatically and this dashboard will provide the latest weight and also whether you have met your weight goal or not and more importantly for each of the fitness activities that you planned it will highlight whether you have met those goals or not for example for the latest week my goal was to walk 210 minutes and i only walked 160 minutes so that's only 76% of my goal so now it is red in color because i haven't even reached my threshold of 80% of my goal but let's say for biking i have biked 47 miles even though my target was only 45 miles so that is green and i have exceeded my goal there so the activities will show up in red green or yellow based on whether you met the goals or not this is extremely useful if you're not able to meet your weight goal then you need to know which activities you're not executing correctly or enough and by knowing those activities you can make an increased effort in the coming week to make sure that you stick to your plan achieve the goals for those fitness activities for example for next week i want to make sure that i give more importance and stick to my walking plan in order for me to reach my goal for walking 
So let's say if you're able to execute all of the activities according to plan, but still you're not able to reach your weight goal, one thing you can do is to try different kinds of fitness activities that you didn't think about before, which could be more effective. Or you may need to increase the amount or the duration of the activities that you are doing. So increase your targets more than what you had before. Weight loss is a very complicated subject and I'm, I'm no way qualified medically to speak about that. But what this template is helping to do is to simplify the task of tracking and measuring your progress. It just makes it a little bit easier for us to focus more on the fitness activities and not worry about planning and tracking because the template will take care of that part of the task. If you have any suggestions on how to improve the template or if you have questions about how to use the template, please put them in the comments below. If you found this template useful, I'm sure that you'll find some others on inzara.com also useful. So please check them out. And thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all soon in another video. Thank you.